I'm on my way home. Unless, of course, there's something you need me for that you can't admit to. No. Unless there's some reason you want to stay that you can't fess up to. Ha! Bad chance. Oh. Ma, what are you doing here? I came to talk to him. I beg your pardon? How can you sleep at night knowing my daughter is living in that dump? Traveling back and forth at all hours of the night. Ma, you can't talk to my boss like that. And you, pack your bags. You're moving back in. No, I'm a grown woman. I'm not afraid of you. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, Mommy. Sylvia, it appears your daughter has made her decision and it's simply not your place to... <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll send the limo for her things. Ma, this is the most embarrassing thing you have ever... Oh, good, he's gone. Ma, you were fabulous! <laughs> I owe you. All I ask in return is a cup of coffee, a few snap wells, and maybe a grandchild. <laughs> well, let's start with the cup of coffee. That I can make by myself. Sylvia, you were something. <laughs> As promised, two tickets to Showbo for you and Morty. Oh, I guess we'll eat at home first. <laughs> and dinner for two at Sardi's. Oh, if you insist. <laughs> so, I, uh, I take it you're moving back in. Well, you know, for my sake. Well, she only has your interests at heart. How much did it cost you? <laughs> Showboat tickets, you? Grandchildren. <laughs> uh, look, um, <clears throat> I intended this as an apartment warming present, but, uh, well, welcome home. Oh, Mr. Sheffield, that is so sweet. Judy Garland. <laughs> 